multi-boat universe. Let's see what's gonna happen. We got a big old car tonight. And we starting this off Here with a battle royal. Coming up as a form of combat that person. Just not any kind of battle royal. Every man for himself. Look like we got ourselves an eight man battle royal. Yep. Some more Joe, Rich Swan, Braun Strowman, The Miz, Neville, um, Apollo, Big Show, and T.J. Perkins. This should be a good match here to open up the show. It should be an incredible one here. Every last one of these guys is big names. Especially Neville. Especially Joe. Especially Braun. This is going to be a good one. What about entrance still on? We got to fix that. Eventually. Alright. This is going to skip this. Y'all can't hear the music. Skip it all of this. Mine doesn't matter. Alright, we're on the way. This battle royal. And out the gate. Look at this by Braun Strowman already trying to take out the Bit Show. This ain't looking good for the Bit Show. Braun Strowman and Bit Show know each other very, very well. And we know how dangerous the more Joe is. TJP is probably the smartest fry in there. And look at Bit Show taking a page out of Braun Strowman book with that power uh, running power slam. Tell you right now, the cruiserweight really don't have a chance of the match, but anything can happen. We did see a Kazira Kazara beat Brock Lesnar in the biggest upset in the Michael uh, um, Universal. And what a boot right there by Samoa Joe to Neville. And Joe looking to take a part. And look at TJ Perkins trying to fly on the big show. That ain't going to happen. And Miz. Former WWE Champion, main event in WrestleMania against John Cena. And look at it by Joe with them nasty elbows right to the gut of Neville. And we just got us some chaos here. Oh, man, with nasty shot right in the back of Samoa Joe. And look at Neville with shots of his own. And TJ Perkins, they trying to take out Joe here. Samoa Joe might be eliminated. Is it going to happen? That is the question. TJP trying to take out Samoa Joe. How big would that be for him? Not going to happen. Remember, TJP been saying how he should be on the main roster. Oh, that suplex. Little Joe here. Joe C. Miz. What a stump to the chest here. There's an eye reversal. Big Show is on that um, t uh, apron. And look at this by Apollo Crews with them punches. So far, nobody got eliminated. Look at Joe here, about to skin the cat. And wait a minute. Miz to tuck out some more Joe. Oh, my goodness. You know Joe going to be pissed off for that one. And look at this. Miz trying to take out Neville. And look at this. Apollo Crews going to help him. They're going to try to take out Asian Neville. Neville is in a lot of trouble. He's holding on for dear life. Can he survive it? That is the caution. 
And the king of the cruiserweights, what a shot, big punch rack to the face of the mid. And Braun is taking out here TJ Perkins. It looked like Braun finna throw him over the ropes. Over that turnbuckle. And this is not looking good. TJ is rocking, but what a shot right to Braun. And we know how powerful Braun is. Look at the power of the bitch show. Just lifting him up and dropping her down. And what a nasty cutter right there by Adrian Neville. That was nasty. Just plain disgusting. And look at Braun just tossing the mids like yesterday trash. And look at Neville. Got up um, a part of Cruz here. Nasty shot right to uh, Braun Scrum. That's how you take the big man down. You go after the knees. And you can pop and break those knees. And that was Miz Dinkin. Remember, Miz just eliminated Samoa Joe. Looking to eliminate Braun Strowman now. Is it definitely trying to be something that might uh in this universe um mode here? In this universe, I say universe. And look at the Miz trying to eliminate uh, no, sorry, TJ Perkins trying to eliminate the bitch show. I don't see that happening on time soon. Anything can happen, any man can win. This has been a crazy opening match here. And here we go. Look at this. Rich Swan with a nine inverted DDT on the cruiserweight. King of the cruiserweight, Adrian Neville. What a shot right there. Oh my goodness, Big Show just tossed TJ Perkin almost out the ring with that move. That far away slam. And no way in the hat. No way in hat. Rich Swan is trying to eliminate Braun Strowman. I'm bad. No, that ain't happening. Oh, ho, ho. How about a left hand for your, your effort? Rat right into the face, just jamming that uh, fist rat right to the face of uh, a TJ Perkins. And Rick Swan and uh, Apollo Cruz letting him go at it. Brown Strowman and Big Show. Oh boy, look at this, the power of the Braun. What a power slam. And these guys are going at it, Neville. Trying to get rid of the mid, the mid finding a way back in. And here we go, Braun Strowman looking to get rid of the bitch show. Is it possible? We just seen him power bomb the bitch show, but he's trying to eliminate the bitch show. Braun is a monster. Can he do it? And he did! Braun Strowman just tossed out the bitch show like yesterday trash. Oh my god. And this is a fight, ladies and gentlemen. Look at it, uh, Braun Strowman with a stomp there. Absolutely a fight here. And I'm telling you, I, my pick, 100% at Braun Strowman. Ladies and gentlemen, remember, y'all can choose. Y'all are the GM um, of this universe, a.k.a. the name is the People Universe. So y'all want to see a certain person go for a title. Or have, you want to put one of your peoples in this universe. You are more than welcome. This is what it's all about. And wait a minute. Neville looking to get rid of the Miz. Not going to happen. Braun Strowman looking to get rid of Rich Swan, And he did. Braun is on fire. And this is my pick. Braun Strowman for the win. Bam. What a shot to the face. And look at this. Neville and Braun going at it. What a punch to Braun's face. And this is a fight European uppercut right there. And that's why he's Neville. That's why he's so good. One of the best high flyers in the WWE. Oh, my God. What a shot by Braun. Knocking TJ Perkins out. Miz with a nice elbow on Neville. And now look at this. Miz setting him up, just stalking him. This is what Miz, uh, Neville need to be in trouble um, careful with. And look at this. Neville, nice German suplex. And we're out there waiting for him at King Kong himself, Braun Strowman. Oh my God, nasty elbow right to the back, right in the front of the head. Since all that hand bit chop right there, not gonna happen. Braun Strowman trying to do something. Never with a nasty kick right to the back of the head. That injury, incongruity kick. And watch this, going after the legs. And wait a minute, TJP. What TJ Perkins doing it over the ropes? He goes. Taking out a part of crew and TJ with a beautiful hurricane runner, ladies and gentlemen. We are down to four competitors in the Matt Nasty shot right there. And here goes Neville with a cutter. 
Oh my goodness, and, and look at that, a part of Cruz, it, it's starting to get to him, the frustration, uh, not with a what? Neville, just eliminate Braun Strowman, are you kidding me? Well, there go my freaking <laughs> Neville just do Braun Strowman out the rain. Look at this. TJP all right to the legs of the oh oh wow, Miss is bleeding. I can't believe my eyes. I would have bet my life. I would have bet my house. Braun would have walked out of this one victorious. But I guess I was wrong. Oh well, so be it. That's the thing about uh and a cutter right there by um TJP. Looking for something big here. Apple red right to the heart of the Miz. Neville going for a chop here. Who gonna win this? TJP looking to do some big damage here by eliminated King of the Cruiserweight. Adrian Neville is hanging in by a thread. And no, oh, I thought he was out, but look at this. Oh my goodness. TJP is trying to eliminate Neville. And look at this, the Miz is up. TJ might want to watch his back. Miz gonna taunt. Just gonna mark his opponents. Mid feel like he got this in the back. Mid feel like this is his battle royal to win. Backing up. Big close on TJP is not over the ropes yet. Oh my goodness. What a net uh, running net breaker there. And here it go. Looking for something big. Oh, turning around into a net breaker. This is bad news for TJP. Miz is full control here. Nice shot right into the rib cage. And watch this here by TJP. Got to be thinking Brain Buster. And that's what it is. Brain Buster right on the Miz. Miz could be in trouble. Remember, it was Neville who eliminated Braun Strowman. Yeah, I think I, <laughs> I am surprised. I have to keep saying that Braun Strowman actually was eliminated by no other than the king of the cruiserweights, Neville. And oh, super kick right there to the Miz. Miz could be in trouble. Big close line. Miz almost went over the ropes. Miz hanging in by thread. And look at level. I mean, look at um TJP going to adapt for us. Miz is fired up, riled up. Neville look like he have nothing left in the tank. TJP might be eliminated here. Miz is backing up. Big close line and almost sun him over the ropes. But somehow TJP is hanging in by thread. Three, three men want this win. They want this W. And they willing to do everything. They take him that bazooka knee right there by the men stealing Daniel Bryan move yet again. Never with an inverted DDT. And this is back and forth. This one go. Taking him over the ropes. TJP in a lot of trouble. And never eliminate TJP. It down to Miz and Adrian Neville. Oh boy, here we go. What's gonna happen here? Big punch right to the face. Neville looking for something big. Miz with nice elbow shots right to Neville's face here. Neville could win this uh, this this eight man battle royal. Is it possible? That's the question. Apple ran into the gut of the Miz. Back and forth in one go. Big kick right to the leg. Uh, legs. Look at this. Adrian Neville mid pushing Adrian out the way. Big anchor giving kick right to the mid. Adrian Neville got an opportunity here. Going straight after the arms of the Miz. Miz want this win. He know this will put him on the top. And the people who watching might want Miz for another WWE Championship. And ladies and gentlemen, this is the last Raw before our pay per view. Probably on Saturday or Sunday. Don't have the date. But here we go. Jaw breaker by Adrian. Neville went for that spinning kick. Miz move out the way. Neville got something big in mind. Will he do the impossible? I say it with no way. A cruiserweight can win. And Neville absolutely proved me wrong. By God, Neville with the W here. Neville wins this match. Neville is the man. Wow. Back and forth it went. I, I got to give it up to Neville. Neville proved without a shout of a doubt that he is the king of the cruiserweight. He is the best hot flyer in the WWE. How big is that to eliminate Braun Strowman and survive eight minutes and win a match like this? 
I say that definitely deserves a title shot here for Adrian Neville, king of the cruiserweights. Wow. The man is amazing. The man is great. I could sing the praises of Adrian Neville all day. He got the job done, and that what matters at the end. Akira Tazara versus Gold Dust. There he goes. Akira Tazawa, the only man who got a win on Brock Lesnar. Got to be proud of himself. We know how good he is. We know how how fast and quick he is. The, the man with the most stamina out of anybody. Let's see what happened here. Going up against Golden Dutch. Killer sure is ready, ready here. Killer oh, fired up. He ready to go. Oh, what the? Brock Lesnar still not over it. Still going after Akira Tazara. And Brock Lesnar want a piece of him. Brock Lesnar want a piece of Akira Tazara. He still can't get over that that loss. You know what they say? You you know Brock Lesnar is not good at losing. This man wanted to win and hurt people. That's his goal. And look at this going straight after Akira Tazara. That could be bad news for Akira Tazawa, an angry Brock Lesnar, and not a good Brock Lesnar. Let me tell you that. And there you go, Akira going at Brock Lesnar again. Big kick right here. Would it be the second time that Brock Lesnar lose? That is the question. Oh, back suplex by Brock Lesnar. Yeah, it seems like Brock Lesnar could never just get over it. Brock Lesnar is just so pissed off and on fire. Akira Tazawa beat him. One, two, three in that rain. He can't take it. And this is this is ridiculous. The beat up goes to oh wow. Oh my goodness. And then Brock Lesnar not playing around here. And the smiles, the games, the fun, all that stuff is gone. Look at Brock Lesnar. Apple ran right into the chest of Akira Tazara and not stopping. And look, now he's reversing right there by Akira Tazara. Here go, big chop right there, right to the chest of Brock Lesnar. Another chop. This is what Akira Tazawa got to do here. And these guys is trying to tell each other apart. We don't know what happened here. And wait a minute. Akira Tazawa telling Brock Lesnar to bring it on. But wait, the, the ref had to. Ref stopped the match. Okay, the ref just. Okay, I don't know why the ref stopped the match, but the ref stopped the match. Maybe the maybe the ref stopped the match because he was fearing for Akira Tazawa live. Maybe that's the case. But wherever it is, we don't know. Yeah, whatever it is, we have no idea why the ref would stop the match, but the ref stopped the match. Well, moving on to the next match, peoples. Okay, here we go. Next match, it's going to be the Brian Kendrick going up against Mark Henry. I had never seen the ref stop the match, but the ref stopped that match. For whatever reason, I don't know the reason. I don't know why, but I know the ref stopped the match. That's all I know. I think the ref was feeling, uh, starting to feel bad for Akira Tazara. And plus, you got to remember, that was not an official match. Brock Lesnar tried to attack Akira Tazawa. That was not an official match. D. Brian Kendrick going up against the world's strongest man, Mark Henry. Here we go. Oh, knee right to the face, coming out the gate with the knee by the man with the plan. Oh, big knee right there. Brian Kings with, with some kicks right there and a headbutt to dang you see that he just headbutt my Henry my Henry shook it off like it was nothing I didn't realize what that what that was it we can rock hit me I don't know what that was tiny little rock oh man well strong man for a reason looking to do a major major damage to oh my god what a boot to the face and Mark Henry just absolutely trying to dominate. Brian Kendrick. Oh my goodness. Sidewalk slam. 
Left to the back, big kick left to the back here. And Miami might get, nope. And there you go. Brian Kendrick in the rain. Mount Henry lifting him up, looking to do something. Big Brian Kendrick jump over, big knee to the back, bringing the big man down for a second there. Oh! And this is what Brian Kendrick need to do. Use that speed, use that high flying, and go straight out the front. Henry running to the chest here. That might be enough. Mark Henry might be in trouble. One, two, and no. Brian Kendrick. Got to stay up on him. Got to can't give him a chance to breathe. And that what Brian doing here. The man with the plan and the plan might be coming to to vision. And no, oh, right into the arm of Brian Kendrick. And what about payback right there? Ran right into that arm of oh, breaking that shoe in the face. It's Brian Kendrick. Big drop kick. Not gonna bring the big man down. What about another shot? Not gonna happen. Brian Kendrick looking for a cutter. Not going to happen. Mark Henry just going to get him off him. Saying, get the heck off of me. And a sob. No, I'm sorry. A Samoa drop. Mark Henry is feeling it here. And, and you can see Brian Kendrick trying to get on his feet here. Mark Henry bit shot right to the chest. Uh, oh, boy. Brian Kendrick, there go Brian Kendrick in a combination with those chops. Not gonna happen. Mark Henry just gonna reverse it. And look at this here, just lifting him up. Shades of Braun Strowman with the running power slam. Wow. It just feel no like no way Brian Kendrick can survive this big kick right to the face here. Went for that boot. And look at this here. Bam. That's a beat down here by Mark Henry. Jet dragging the caucus, center of that ring. And watch this knee here. Bam! Right in the face of Brian Kendrick. You don't match with the world's strongest man. You just don't. Uh, what Bri uh, Mark Henry, uh, Brian Kendrick got in mind here. Brian Kendrick going all the way up, looking to do something big here. And that drop kick might do it. That drop kick might just do it. Might be the key he needed to open the door for the win. No. Mark Henry kicking out. If you, Brian Kendrick, you got to think, what guy, What do you do to beat a man like Mark Henry, a former WWE champion? Now, wait a minute. Maybe that would do it. A The world's strongest man, a man who flip over cars, Broke fly, frying plans. How can you beat this monster? We already know Brian Kendrick. Oh, went for that. Didn't get it. Not going well for Brian. And look at Mark Henry just lifting him up here. What Mark Henry got in mind? Had something in mind. Oh. And look at this. Just, oh, what a nasty shot. And there it go, Brian Kendrick looking for something. Mark Henry wrecked to the legs. Oh, power slam of Brian Kendrick. As I say, just a slam. <laughs> and there it goes. Would that be enough here? Brian Kendrick might be done for one, two, and no. Oh, Brian Kendrick again, the shoulders up at two. I thought that was it. If I were Brian Kendrick, I would have stayed down at like I don't know what happened here. That would have been me. I would have just been like, I'm staying down. I'm not getting back up. Oh, uh, look at this. D. Brian Kendrick is in a lot of trouble. Look at this. Mark Henry is just wrenching that neck. I just pray that he don't rip it off. Good gravy. Mark Henry is just destroying. Word of today, destroying Brian Kendrick. What a shot to the head of Mark Henry. And up Brian Kendrick with the captain hook. Oh, no. Brian Henry getting to the rope there. That was the biggest opportunity that Brian Kendrick had. Brian Kendrick going up high. If he hit this, oh, again, right to the gut of Mark Henry. That might be enough. One, two, and no. Mark Henry getting the shoulders up at two. At two, Mark Henry get the shoulder up. That's what kind of man. Oh, big boot. Big giant boot to the face of Mark Henry. And oh, man, ouch. 
to E. Brian Kendrick is starting to feel it here, taking it to my Henry. My Henry might be in trouble. What a shot right there. Brian Kendrick, top rope here. Brian Kendrick looking to fly like Superman here. Can it happen? Brian went across body. Right on my Henry. The man with the plan. Brian Kendrick is starting to take it to that next level. That's exactly what he needed to do. A lot of people look at Brian Kendrick and say he will have lose. He he not gonna win this match. But Brian Kendrick looking to prove them wrong. He got oh wait a minute. Oh move right there. Wrapped by Brian too. And my Henry getting the shoulders up. You gotta be thinking slight spread number two. Or you gotta be thinking. Wow, look at that. He's saying it's over. You gotta be thinking that submission. The captain hook. Oh no. What are you thinking here? And would it be able to work on my Henry? No, just look at him in the face. Ooh. Ooh, apple. Apples after apples. And a big man goes down. I right, look at this by Brian Kendrick. Stalking my Henry. Oh, my Henry, what a reversal here. What a reversal. And look at this bear hug here. Right to Brian Kendrick. I think he might tap out. If he don't find a way out of here, Mark Henry is going to make D. Brian Kendrick tap out. Oh. Oh. Just a nasty shot. Oh, box right to the ears of Mark Henry. He can't hear nothing. Mark Henry, nice reversal right there. Just absolutely a nice reversal and tossing him. Yeah, yesterday trash. Oh, Mark Henry and Pitts. Mark Henry and Pitts. Oh, Brian. With a reversal in the head, but right to my Henry. What about the second one? My Henry got Brian Kendrick. Oh, wrenching that arm. They're going to drag that arm, that right arm. And look at this spot. Brian Kendrick choking the life on my Henry. I oh, remember he went for this once and missed. Looking to get it this time. Beautiful move right there. One, two. And Mark Henry getting that shoulder up some way, somehow. This has been a physical war here. A war for a fight. No one thought my, uh, Brian Kendrick could hang in there with the world's strongest man. And he did. Oh, my God. He hung him. That might be it. One. And no, Brian Kendrick going to get that shoulder up. And look at this. Bam! Wrapped right to the face of Bryant. Wait for something not going to happen. Mark Henry again. Set him up. What is this? Oh! Headbutt. Phase of the junkyard dog. Oh! Nasty shot right there. And Mark Henry looking to put this one away with the world. Nope. No, 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 no. Taking a page out of Braun Strowman book with the running power slam. And now, Mark Henry waiting to put this one away. Oh, no he ain't. And look at this here. Bye. Oh my goodness. That could be it. One, two. And Mark Henry gets the shoulders up. Mark Henry. Got the shoulders up, and look at this. Raising no time is D. Brian Kendrick stalking him. And it is time. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. He got him in that captain hook. Can Mark Henry survive it? That's the question. And Mark Henry might have to tap out. Mark Henry might tap. He had that thing locked in. And it over. My Henry had to tap out. D. Brian Kendrick beating the world's strongest man with the captain hook. He locked that in. Yeah, you seen when Brian Kendrick had that in. He did not let go. He would not let go. He just kept going for it. He would not give up. He would not let it go. Man, I'm telling you, my Henry got to be a lot in a lot of pain he i think he had that on almost a, a minute but that box to the ear right there brian kendrick 
and let's get pumped right to the rib cage of the world's strongest man, Mark Henry. And Brian Kendrick definitely deserved that win. Wow. Talk about fighting for your life. And that's what Brian Kendrick did. He fought for his life. There you go. Just going to show off a little bit. D. Brian Kendrick. That captain hook, man. You got to understand that is a brutal and nasty twisted move that like a choke. And Mark Henry, you know, like, how you could get out of that? That's the question. How the heck you get out of a move like that? Tell you right now, Mark Henry didn't know. All Mark Henry could do is just watch and and, and, and just suffer. Yeah, he just, Mark Henry just could not get out of that. No matter how strong you are, the way he had the neck, the way he had the body, you couldn't get out of it. There was no way to push up with your knees, nothing. It was just your whole body flat while you, somebody got a net lock on you. A brutal net lock. And here we go, Nia Jax going up against Alicia Fox. And remember, Nia Jax definitely trying to make a statement here to um, Shasha D. Banks, the women champion, looking to make a statement by taking down Alicia Fox. Oh, uh, I don't think that was smart right there by Alicia Fox. And the power of Anaya Jax. Wasting no time just picking her up like a kid. And look at this by Alicia Fox going to try to out-wrestle Naya. Look at Naya go here. Bringing in the wrestling move. Oh, my goodness. Just powering Alicia Fox down. Already looking for something big. It's Naya Jax. But now you got in mind a version of a snake eyes. Down goes Alicia Fox. And looking for a sidewalk slam. Or would that be a backbreaker? Yeah, definitely a backbreaker. Just going to work on the back of Alicia Fox. They're trying to break her back and a kick to the back right there. And they're like, Nia Jess is not going by time. Looking to put this one away really quick. Nice versus by Nia Jack, catching up, setting up, and a suplex for Alicia Fox. And look at this, stomping away is Nia Jack. Vicious stuff here by Nia. Wait a minute. Nia is telling this. Who is that? Alessa Blitz. Wait a minute. That's a big blitz coming out. Oh, man, what um. Uh, uh, arm drag right there stomping away that's going to give the leverage to well Alicia Fox Alessa Blitz might just screwed Nia Jackson Nia was on the roll but Alessa got a little distracted by Alicia Fox oh my goodness what is this oh no 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 oh my goodness face first to the mat. That could be it. That could be it. Got it. One. Two. No, it's over. Alicia Fox picking up the win. Alessa Blitz absolutely screwing Anaya Jax out of this win. Wow. And there goes the troublemaker herself, Alessa Blitz, and Anaya at Pitts. Nia, like, come on, you piece of garbage. I'm going to kick your face into next week. No, how you going to do that, but she'll find a way. Wow. Talk about a screw job right there. Let's a blitz decide to, her music decide to play it, distracting Nia Jack. And, well, that gave Alessia, uh, um, yeah, um, Alicia Foster opportunity to take advantage of it. And remember, ladies and gentlemen, y'all are the GM. Anybody who watched it could be new, could be old, could be whatever. Y'all the GM of this universe, Mo. Fact is the fact that it says the people universe. Me, y'all could book the matches. Y'all can put whoever you feel in a title match. Y'all are the GM of the universe, Mo. So, there you go. If you didn't know, now you know.
Just message me or leave a comment and let me know who you want to see do what. Uh, if you want to put some people's in, you want Kenny Omega, the Young Bucks, uh, Akira Tazar, whoever you want. Let me know. And we're going to be quiet here and see what Nikki James have to say. I think Nikki's starting to feel like she's getting lost in the shuffle. Oh boy, Nikki is a little upset. That can't be good. One of the most popular superstars in the WWE, no question. Oh boy. Uh oh. She want a fight. She looking for a special fight. Who are you talking about? Oh boy! She calling out the women champion. The question is, what the women champion answer? She are calling out the balls herself, and that's Sasha Banks. You gotta be amazed here, Nikki Jane is calling out Sasha Banks. Tell you right now, Sasha Banks, women champion, we're not going to sit back and listen to any more of that garbage. Her vein coming out like she's going to mess up um, uh, Nikki Jane. Remember Nikki Jane said she's looking for a fight. She want a fight here. She want a special fight, and she probably got it right now. Oh, wow. Shall we? <laughs> Shall we? Somebody yes. We down. say fight. Okay. Oh, wow. Well, I say I know who she is. That's the women champion, Shasha Banks. Oh, wow. Well, Nikki Jane got the attention of Sasha Bank, the women champion. Sasha Bank want to fight. And that's how you make it in the WWE. You get people attention by calling them out. Let's say we want them in the ring now. Let's say let's say Shasha Bain just put the women championship on the line right here, right now. Give us our match now.
<laughs> wow, the world of Boogie Man is not signed here in WWE, not this time and day. It's scaring the kids too much. Wow. That's a bang and pun down the log. You just all talk. She's the champ. She can say and do whatever she wants. Even Nikki, Nikki James dumb find it. Nikki don't know what happened there. But yeah, you call out the champ. That's a good thing. But the fact of the matter is, the champ might roast you. Yeah, like roast you like a pig. No rest for the weary. All right, here we go. Get ready for some we got Roman Reigns going up against the Big Dog. I'm sorry. Huh, Roman Reigns going up against the Big Dog. Bray Wyatt going up against the Big Dog, Roman Reigns. We have Roman Reigns. Will Wyatt succeed here? Or will he be defeated here by Roman Reigns? That is the question. And remember, Bray Wyatt been woken, so I don't know. Roman Reigns definitely look like he might have a hard time here. I'm just saying. Woken Bray Wyatt. He is woken. Let's see what happened. Ring the bell, ref. Big kick right there by Bray. Roman Reigns, nice on drive right there. Looking, picking up Bray here and going to dump him right on the floor. And Roman Reigns coming out the gate just vicious here. And look at Bray, nice reversal. Big punch right to the head of Reigns. And oh, right to the eye. Bray Wyatt is not taking it lightly on the big dog. He definitely not. He was woken. Ooh, nasty shot. Right into the, and a right to the eye again. And break with a T-bone. Looking to put this one away quickly. What? No. I got one. Roman Reigns said, get that out my house. Went for something. Night reverse there. Russia last week by Roman Reigns. Ray Wyatt going to buy some time. Going to roll out that ring. And look at Bray just playing head games. My first kick right there for Roman Reigns. Punches, kicks, combination. And what Roman got in mind here? Nope, not going to happen. Bray with a reversal. And looking for a scoop slam. No, Roman Reigns going to go over with a DDT. Planning Bray Wyatt head first to the mat. Dropping the elbow right in the chest of Bray Wyatt. What about one more? And here you go. Roman Reigns dragging him. And now going to work on his hands and bounce off the rope. Went for something. Bray rolls out the way. Bray with a nice reversal into a backbreaker. Big kick right there by Bray Wyatt. And a nasty like a uppercut shot right to the face of Roman. And there you go. What Bray got in mind? What about a gut buster? The big dog is taking a beating here by Bray Wyatt, eater of the world. Uh, like I like to say, eater of hot pockets. Shot right there by Bray Wyatt. Oh, man. And here go the beating for Roman Reigns again. Pound it into Miss Me. Look at the power here by Bray Wyatt. And Edward not Smart just mocking Roman Reigns here. Bray really believe he have this one. In the back. Oh, man. Cannonball by Bray Wyatt. Oh, what a shot right there. And here goes Roman Reigns trying to come back here. Got him up. Looking to take him down is Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns going for the pin. Would that be enough? One. No, it is not. Bray Wyatt getting that shoulder up. Roman Reigns is in attack mode here. Going after the head of Bray Wyatt. Roman bitch stump right there. Got him up. Got to be thinking power bomb here. And that's exactly what Roman Reigns thinking. What a power bomb 
by Roman Reigns. And look at it, Bray going to go over, coming out the back door with an inverted DDT. And a, oh, headbutt right to the chest of Roman Reigns. Bray said, feel good. What about another one? Going for two. Would that be enough? One. Nope. Yeah, right now we see Roman Reigns kick out a four L5 five. I believe a four five L5. Chuck he's gonna take way more than that to beat Roman Reigns. Oh boy, look at this. Look at this. Look at the hang up. Bray Wyatt. Honking right on the ropes. And Apple right to the lid of Bray Wyatt. Roman Reigns gonna look to do some damage here. Take it to the turnbuckle. What Roman got in mind. Gonna take him to the second turnbuckle with that oh close line. What a fight this is. Nice versus right there by Bray Wyatt to Roman Reigns. Went for the chop. Roman Reigns going for a wild punch right there. You don't pin uppercut. And look at it by Bray Wyatt. Gotta be thinking punk handle slam. But look at the power right there by Roman Reigns. And a Superman punch. This one could be over. But yeah, this one could absolutely be over. You know, once a Superman punch comes, it literally means game over. Because that spirit might be right around the corner. And Bray in a lot of trouble here. Just a lot of trouble. Bray finding a way to survive, finding a way to fight out of it. And here goes Bray Wyatt. Nasty shots right to Roman Reigns. And here it goes. No. Oh, boy. Bray is in trouble here. Roman Reigns have kicked it to that next gear. You know when he do, it's bad news for anybody. Bray might be in trouble. One, two, and Bray get the shoulders up. Not enough to beat the eater of the world. Bray White. And here we go. Suplex by Bray. Getting a perfect suplex, which is right on the back of Roman Reigns and no it's not going to be three again Roman could kick out of anything the man like him or hate him <clears throat> the man is really he got that stamina he can go you know and for me I hate saying that but hey man is good bam right to the arm of Bray Wyatt and Roman and looking for some brave with a night reversal. And oh, what a stump to the chest. And look at Bray Wyatt again, him up, going for a scoop slam by Bray. What Bray got in mind, whatever it was, he got away. Oh, inverted DDT. Oh, and another Superman punch to Bray. Bray could be out. One. Two and no Bray kicks out at two after a powerful Superman punch right to the face of Bray Wyatt. Bray with a reverse of it on. And Roman Reigns turning around. Oh shoulder block. Stumping away on Bray. And oh, Bray with a kick to the face. I think Bray feel like he in control. Yuganagi, bam! Roman Reigns just caught that Yuganagi. And look at Bray. Oh, right to the legs of Roman. Roman Reigns is taking his beating here. That's a shot by Roman Reigns. Bray got to be worried about it. And oh, went for the spear. Bray Wyatt with a reversal. Wyatt with a reversal. And look at Bray. Stalking Roman Reign here. Got to be thinking. The sister Abigail not going to happen. Not is not going to happen. Roman seen it coming. Roman absolutely seen it coming. Oh, nasty shot. Oh, Roman is backing up. Roman backing up. Ooh, ah, would it be? Oh, he hit him. He flew over there like a rocket. 
spear to Bray, almost spear right out of his skin. Bray is hurt. Bray is down. Roman may have this win here. This one might be over. Referee, let's on the count. One, two, and it's over. Roman Reigns picks up the win. Spear rat to Bray. Bam! That's the first knockout shot with that Superman punch. Well, it took two and one spear to put away the eat of the hot pockets. And watch this. Kick out right there by Bray Wyatt. Roman Reigns. Bam! What a shot. Bam! Just another shot. Nasty shot to the face. To the face, in the face, Bray Wyatt, whatever it is, he's down. Here is your winner, Roman, Roman Reigns picks up a huge win here. Getting the job done is Roman Reigns. Like the man or hate him, you can't take nothing away from this guy. That Superman punch really do hurt. <laughs> You got to think this one might not be over with Bray and Roman. Hmm. Yeah, I think Bray thinking if he could hit, if he could have hit that sister Abigail, it could have been over. But uh, unfortunately, it did not work that way. All right, here we go. A real, real crazy rivalry this is. Yeah, this rivalry is totally out of control. This rivalry is over the top here we've seen dean ambrose gave it 110 percent last week to beat carl anderson and still fell carl anderson luke gatos is on fire here well the shield it definitely frustrated okay i know self is tired of it i know dean is tired of it but the good brothers luke gatos carl anderson definitely had their numbers There you go. This one is on the way. We ring in the bell here. Big punch right there by Seth Rollins. Ooh, nasty shot. And watch this. Oh, Seth Rollins is out the gate. Remember, the Shield only beat these guys once. Carl Anderson, Luke Gatto beat the Shield three times already. And then you, if you count, Dean Ambrose losing to Carl Anderson. That's like five. And look at this. This time, Shield is not playing around, though. This time, Seth Rodden, Dean Ambrose is not playing with Luke Gatos and Carl Anderson. They're coming out the gate. They're swinging. And that's smart right there, tagging in Dean Ambrose just to beat the crap out of Luke Gatto. Keep him in your corner. Beat him up. And that's what Dean Ambrose looking to do here. Taking him outside the ring. And not small right there, just taunting. Oh no, Dean coming for him. Dean want that behind. Dean want to beat him up. Take him old school style. Beat him senseless and old oh, face first to them stairs. Dean Ambrose. Looking to just take out Luke Gatos here. You caught Luke, Got uh, Luke Goddard were trying to, uh, but not no more. Will you tag him? Yes, he tagged in Carl Anderson. And here we go. D2 been going at it for a while. But look at Dean with them punches. Left and right, just a nasty shots here. And look at Dean firing up, bouncing off the rope. And oh, nasty kick to Carl. Carl Anderson going to feel that one for a, a while. Dean came in, fire up. Oh, what a kick. Dean Ambrose came in fire up. Night reversal right there by Carl Anderson. Oh, into a verdict DDT. 
beautiful inverted DDT. I might add. Going for a power bomb here. And oh my goodness, running power bomb right to Dean. And Carl Anderson been having Dean Ambro Nimble. I think Dean need to make a tag to self because they like Carl Anderson know Dean so well. Oh my goodness, what a stump to the chest. That he could easily beat Dean every day. That that's how much he know Dean Ambrose. They're gonna tag in Big Loot. Dean Ambrose in a lot of trouble here. The good brothers, they're having too much fun. Oh my goodness. A axe handle right to the back. Dean Ambrose looking to make a tag, but Luke Goddard's gonna cut him off at the path. Right to the legs of Ambrose. Oh my goodness. Apple right to the back right there. Luke Gatto got him up. Dean gonna come out the back door with in, uh, inverted DDT. What Dean doing? Dean should have went for the the tag right there. Oh, Big Luke crushing Dean Ambrose. Dean almost there and he makes it. And here goes Seth Rollins. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> Luke Goddard just met Seth Rollins with a boot to the face. And now, sidewalk slam by Bit Luke Goddard. Wow. Yeah, I think Seth thought he had something there. It just ran into a boot. Wow. And look at it. Making a tag to Carl Anderson, Luke Goddard. Stuff got to find a way to turn it around, and this might be it. Now he versus right there by Carl Anderson. Oh, you unpin up a cut. And for a chop, not going to happen. Oh, nice clothesline. Nice clothesline. Went for the stop. A little Carl Anderson. Picking him up, and a... No! Seth Rollins with a reversal. Oh, into a pin. Would that be enough? One, no. Carl Anderson with get kicking out of that. Shot right there by Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins starting to fight up here. Big kick to the face of Carl Anderson. Oh, swing blade. Woo, Seth is on fire. Might not want to tag in D because, well, Carl Anderson know how to beat D. Oh boy, oh man. Seth Rodden feeling it here. Making a tag to Dean Ambrose. And Dean like, where you going? Oh, nice versus. Playing a little possum there is Carl Anderson. Oh boy, Dean is in a lot of trouble. Oh, nice versus by Dean. Oh, knee to the back. Dean Ambrose stumped right there. Taking down. Machine gun Carl Anderson. There go a bulldog. Wrecked to Carl Anderson. Dean Ambrose looking for the pin here. Would it be enough? One. No. You got him breaking it up. Seth Rollins in the rain here. Dean Ambrose. Great right at the eye. Oh, Carl with a big punch right to the chest of Dean. And setting that up with a DDT. Carl Anderson looking to turn this bad boy around. Oh, boy. He's going flying here. Carl Anderson. Dean moves out the way. Oh, inverted DDT by Carl Anderson. Yeah, they got to be irritating for the shield. A team like this to keep finding that weakness to beat you. It can't be fun. Knee to the one. Nope. Dean Ambrose with the shoulder top. It is not enough. Seth Rollins and Luke Gallows outside fighting here. He's coming down to the two who've been fighting for two weeks so far. And now Dean Ambrose and Carl Anderson. And look at this by Dean with a snap near a suplex. Bam! What a punch right to Luke Gatos. And Dean Ambrose in keeping um, Carl Anderson on in their cone attacking in Seth Rollins. This could be bad news for Carl Anderson. Oh! That might be it. That might be enough. One. No. That was small by the shield, taking down the bit, man. Went for the drop kick, not gonna happen. And nice reversal move right there by, oh, Sheen Gun Carl Anderson. 
Looking to make the tag here. Oh, too sweet. Oh, wait. No, he's not going to make the tag. Oh, oh! Shotgun drop kick. One, two, and Seth Rollins got the shoulders up. Big kick right to the back of Seth. Reversal there. Oh, elbow right to the face. By Seth Rollins, the arc attack. Wait for that drop kick, not gonna happen. Seth Rollins, night reversal. Luke Gatto, I mean, Carl Anderson, right to the arm of Seth Rollins. Oh, what a kick. Wow, you've been attacking Bit Luke, and there's nothing they can do about it. And Luke Gatto is in the match. And Luke going straight out to Seth Rollins, wasting no time, going after his man. And there it goes. Big Luke looking for something. Seth Rollins going out the back door with an inverted DDT. And Seth Rollins, what's Seth Rollins thinking here? Rolling him up. Catabla right to the face. Oh, boy, Luke. What well, you got to ask the question. Well, that's a small ideal to tag in Luke Gattles. Oh, and Seth Rollins got something in mind here. And would it be going for that knee? Bam! Right to the face of Luke Gatos. One, two. Oh my God! How did how did Bit Luke kick out of that? Oh, uh, Seth Rollins. Oh, 450 and got nothing. Bit Luke Gatto's kicking out of that knee. Tagging in Dean is Seth Rollins. Oh my goodness. Oh, what a shot. That's going to bust open Luke Gatto's. Oh, Dean with a nasty shot right there. But Dean thinking. Dean setting him up. And wait a minute. Bam! What a shot by Luke Gatto. But Dean, bam! And look at Dean firing up here. And oh, look like he went bam again. Taking down, taking down um Carl Anderson for the second time. Dean set him up. Look for the third. Dean's not gonna get it. Bit Luke Gatos with a nasty shot. Look Luke Gatos. Yeah, he gonna real turn it. Dean was out from that shot. Oh boy, there go the choke slam. Dean in trouble. Oh! Luke Gatos. They taking it to Dean Ambrose. Oh, boy. I think Luke Gatos going to put away Dean. Oh, nice reversal. And they trying to keep Luke Gatos in this match. That will be smart. Tagging in Seth Rollins. It's Dean Ambrose. Bam! Seth Rollins turning a little bit more. Getting caught innocent and oh! Taking the head off right there. And look at Seth going for something big here. Looking to put away Carl. One, two, and no. Back and forth. This one is going left and right. This is going. Look at this. So Rollins looking to plan a but Carl Anderson with a close line. I think Seth Rollins seen it coming. Will Carl Anderson add Seth Rollins on that page? No, Seth Rollins with a reversal. Reversal, reversal, reversal. Oh wow. Back and forth. This one going. Oh. Carl Anderson lifting him up. And a spine buster. Right to Seth Rollins. One. Two. And is it over? Did Dean break it? I think Dean break it up. Dean Ambrose broke it up. Oh my. Oh! Carl Anderson with a shot. Right to Dean Ambrose. Right to Dean Ambrose. Seth Rollins would have Seth Rollins would have been pinned. Dean Ambrose just saved this match. Oh boy, would it be the magic killer? No. Nope. So still have something left in the tank here. 
Oh, Abo. Wow, Dean saved this match. Told you the shield is tired of losing. Oh, what a kick to the face. And Seth absolutely just lost it. Seth lost his mind here. There it goes. That bam, that kick. Seth wasting no time here. Seth Rollins. There it goes. That oh, that knee again. That knee again. Rope break. Oh my. Oh. What? That got to be frustrating for the Shield. They had him. They got to just stay on Carl Anderson. He's hurt. Nope. Carl Anderson with a reversal. Going after the layers of Dean Ambrose. Big chop back there. Going for something. Dean Ambrose with a reverse of it all. Pushing him off. Dean Ambrose going with the road up here. Would that be enough? Would it be enough? One, two, and no. Carl Anderson kicking out. There go that Bulldog again. Oh, small packet by Seth Rollins. Dean Ambrose trying to get the win here. Would it be enough? One, two, and no. For the club versus the Shield. Definitely a fight this is. What Dean doing here? Dean looking for a small package. One, two, AKA Fisherman Suplex. What Dean doing here? Oh, oh, reversal. Carl Anderson with a reversal, going for a power bomb. Dean with a reversal of his own. Big punches direct to the face of big Carl Anderson. A machine gun Carl Anderson, sorry. Oh, just breaking that up. This, this fight spilled outside. Dean looking to do something here. Suplex. Oh. Luke Goddard's it down. Dean Ambrose looking to fly here. Telling Carl Anderson to get up. And look at it. Oh, went for that elbow. And Carl Anderson just simply moves out the way. Nice move right there by Dean Ambrose. Inventing that tag there by Carl Anderson. Trying to make sure Carl don't tag in bit loot. And look at this. Small move here by Dean Ambrose. Just putting him on his side. Oh, threat to the face. Tagging himself. And there he goes. What's going to happen? Job breaker. Carl Anderson. Going for something with a swing in that breaker. Oh, boy. What's going to happen? Carl Anderson. I think he's thinking magic killer. Yes. Tagging in big Luke Gatos. It looks like it's time for it. Magic killer. That could be it. One. Oh, what? What? Tough running. Just burnt it down. Getting the shoulders up. Red, wow, I am, I'm impressed. He just took the best shot they had and kicked out like it was nothing but what a choke slam by Luke Gatos. Oh, that's just gonna piss them off. When you do your best move and somebody kick out of it just like that, you get pissed off. And oh, some freaking Rollins going high up and a, oh, no. Oh, wow. Seth in a lot of trouble, though. Seth, Seth is in a lot of trouble. But is he? Oh, Lou Goddard with a shot to the head of Seth. There go that kick again. Oh, wow. He don't have nothing left. Lou Goddard's going to take full advantage of that. Looking to tag in Carl Anderson. Seth is hurt. Seth is absolutely hurt. Taking a dream killer and just no selling it. At AKA kicking out of it. Oh no. Seth is bleeding now. So you don't make you don't make the good brothers angry. And that was Seth just did. Oh, that might be it. That might be it. One, 
No, Seth getting his shoulders up. And look at this, Seth going for a pin of his own. No. Oh, what a kick. That's enough to put him away there. Seth, out of nowhere, one, two, and no, Carl Anderson getting his shoulders up. So I'm tagging in Dean Ambrose here. Small by Seth Rollins. Oh, wait a minute. All right, Anderson looking to tag in Luke. Nope. Dean with a reversal. Oh, my God. Luke Gatos just split open Dean Ambrose. And Ambrose is down and out. Yeah, every... Uh, well, all, both of the Shield members is bleeding. And you got to ask what kind of damage that's going to do here. Carl Anderson going to take full advantage of it. Carl Anderson is taking advantage of this. Looking for the pin here. That might do it. Do it. And it did. Dean Ambrose. Carl Anderson pinning him yet again. The Good Brothers. Again. Look at this, Sub Rod and tech checking on Dean Ambrose. Yeah, that that headbutt was vicious, and oh my God, Carl Anderson with a steel chair. And here it goes, beating down the shield yet again. They want to get rid of the shield. They tired of these guys. How many times do they got to keep beating them for them to finally get the picture? By God, it is over just like that. I can't believe what we've seen here, folks. Dean Ambrose got pinned yet again by Carl Anderson. Carl Anderson definitely have the number of Dean Ambrose. What a match. What a bloodbath. What a fight. Wow. I love that match. That match was good. That was definitely a bloodbath. You, if you did not know it, it was a bloody fight. Dean Ambrose, Seth Rollins, they just on a losing streak. I don't know how they're going to get off of it. I don't know what they're going to do to turn it around. Seth proved how good he is. He, they hit him with the magic killer and he kicked off. He, he didn't let the rough either count to one. Seth Rollins. Seth freaking Rollins. All right, let's check out the news. Yeah, this thing with Carl Anderson and Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins got over personal. We don't know what they're going to happen, but ladies and gentlemen, we do know they probably going to fight at the pay-per-view. We're through it matter now because Carl Anderson, Luke Gatto, you're looking at the score, beat the Shield six times, and the Shield only beat them once. That can't be good. That's a blitz in the Nia Jax. Definitely having some issues. Remember, it was Alexa Bliss who just caused Nia Jax against Alicia Fox. Brought Lesnar the Kira Tazara. The referee had to stop the match. These two were trying to tear each other apart. Or should I say, um, Brock Lesnar were trying to tear Akira Tazara apart. And Dean Ambrose and Carl Anderson will be facing each other at payback. Oh, boy. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. That was last week. Sorry. But, uh, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for tuning in for another smashing episode of Monday Night Raw. Um, if y'all like what y'all seen, y'all enjoyed it, uh, hit that follow button. That would be more appreciated. Um, if you want to know when I'm doing it, because I will be doing SmackDown tomorrow, uh, same time, 3 o'clock, um, please um, um, follow me on Twitter. Uh, that is at Nathaniel, at Nathaniel underscore Hobbs. And uh, you'll know anytime I'm going on and stuff like that. Um, so, yeah, guys, uh, thank you for tuning in. Uh Hope y'all enjoy yourself. And, uh, and like I always say, I am Rocket Gamer. And I'll see you at the top. Peace.